Growth Point teaching today takes us to Luke chapter 2, verse number 12, and it reads as follows. This will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in cloths and lying in a manger. We are reminded in this particular verse that God chose to become a man, that God was willing to leave heaven and to be born as a baby. He chose to do that knowing what lay ahead. It would not be pleasant. There would be rejection. There would be betrayal. And finally, there would be a cruel death. Yet he chose to pour out his life. He chose to do this for you and for me. As the world was yearning for a Savior, at the perfect time, a Savior was born. There's only one reaction that we can have to all of this, that our hearts would be filled with joy and excitement and gratitude that God would be willing to be born on this earth and all we can do is fall on our knees and worship Him completely humbling ourselves before Him in absolute awe and complete surrender. There's simply nothing we can do but respond in worship, hearts filled with gratitude and thanksgiving for the birth of Jesus. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, when I reflect on the Savior's birth, I am amazed. What a glorious moment, what a holy moment, what a divine moment. The world was longing for a Savior. The world was longing for someone to rescue them. And your Son, Jesus, became that individual of unconditional love. So we bow our hearts, we bow our heads, we fall on our knees in absolute surrender and worship and we humble ourselves we surrender ourselves so that Jesus can be exalted in our lives I pray this prayer a blessing over you to him who is able to keep you from falling and to present you before his glorious presence without fault and with great joy to the only God our Savior be glory, majesty, power, and authority through Jesus Christ, our Lord, before all ages, now and forevermore. Because of you, Jesus, and the hope of heaven, we believe and we know the best is yet to come. Amen.